Hey guys, I was just going through my baby's hospital bag and I thought it would be kind of a cute video to go ahead and show you what I have packed. So I'm gonna do that today. All right guys, so this is the bag empty on top of everything that I had in it. And I don't want you to think that it was like stuff stuff full. There was definitely still some empty pockets and space for me to fit more items. So we're going to start with the side pockets. So this one over here is insulated for um, full bottles. Yeah. Um, this I think is a really good pocket. It's got, oh wait, no, there's two here. Yeah, so there's two there with some uh, Velcro. Now this pocket, this is a really good pocket for like extra bottles, you know, any tools that you need and then wipes because it's on the outside and it's easy to grab either this pocket or this side pocket here for wipes. This is just regular, it's not insulated inside. But yeah, it's got some like decent room in here. One second. Like decent yeah and it, this is a white pocket because it's got the it's got the zipper yeah so you put your wipes in here and then you've got easy access on the side i love this feature i had that on my last diaper bag too and it was amazing and we've got this guy so this one's just yeah put like a wet bag in there or extra subies yeah all right, and now for the big one. This thing is full of pockets. It's also a backpack style one. Um, yeah, a backpack style. And yeah, I absolutely love it. It's also got hook here, little hook here. Oh my gosh, this thing is just, it's so utility, like such a utilitarian, um, <clears throat> useful thing okay so going in so there's a little bit of a of some damage here but my mom can fix that no problem we've got a big pocket here got two pockets this huge one back here these two net pockets the main one and then two little sides so yeah, crazy. And this is everything that was in this bag. And so here's the bump so far. This is 32 weeks. I've got eight left. So this is the baby's hospital bag. This is the brand, um, land mommy and baby bag chic mom give you the best care all right so let's start with this pocket so i've got three different pacifiers that i'm bringing so i've got this one here i'm not sure i got these ones from walmart um, but this one here is actually glow in the dark. So that's pretty neat. And then this one I got from Winners and it's one of those, uh, straight ones, but it comes with a little snuggle buddy. He's a cute little fox guy. Yeah. And it's so soft and just nice. And I'm excited. And I love that these pacifiers came with um, a, a carrier case. So yeah, that's pretty neat. All right, in the front pocket, I just have a couple. Um, I know that the, the hospital gives you diapers anyway, but I've got a couple Rascal and Friends diapers to try out. And I have two of the Philips um, Avent bottles because what happened with Carson, kitty cat, thank you very much. Because what happened with Carson is he had a really hard time latching when I was trying to breastfeed. 
So what I ended up doing was I bottle fed him, I pumped and I bottle fed him and I just kept trying him on the breast. And by about a month and a half, two months, he latched perfectly fine. And um, it took about that amount of time for it to, for him to be able to get it. And then after that, he was just strictly breast unless we were going somewhere or someone was watching him. So that's how I did it. And that may be the case this time as well. I'm not putting any pressure on myself for how it's going to be. No expectations means no disappointments. So yeah. All right, starting out, I'm bringing this lamb. It sings, uh, Carson picked this out for Thomas and I absolutely love it. And yeah, so this is this little lamb guy is gonna go. Now this is going to be his um, first outfit. This is what I'm gonna put him in after he's born. A friend gave this to me. It's so cute. And it's got the, the hand foldovers, but, and it's also got the double zipper as well. So it's got one at the bottom as well as at the top. Now, the next part and why I'm putting him in this first is it comes with a swaddle blanket. So after he's born and cleaned up and whatnot, I'll be able to put him in his new first outfit and it's so soft and comfy and then we'll be able to swaddle him. Um, yeah, so I think that's really fantastic. I'm very excited. Getting so close, it's wild to me. Um, and then these are just kind of like a fun extra thing. They're newborn size. They're little, they're little dinosaur feeties. Yeah, so I'm excited for those. Next are all the blankets that I'm bringing. And I'll show you all of these. And I'm bringing a plethora of them. So a whole bunch of different ones that are like different feels and textures and whatnot. So this one is a big fluffy cozy blanket and it's got whales on it very soft get out of the diaper bag please and thank you yes i know you don't like that um very soft very cozy so i'll be able to snuggle up with him he's not going to sleep in it but i'll be able to snuggle him up in it and cuddle him and and whatnot so that's that's really great Next, this one I got before I knew I was having a boy, but I have like girlier things. So this one's just like the ship one. That's the texture. It's very stretchy, very soft. I don't think that it is. it should be taboo to put boys in pink pretty things. Um, I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna put them in dresses or anything unless he ends up liking dresses, but um, I love this blanket and it's so cute. So why would I not use it? Right? This is also just a bag. I got this in the NICU with Carson. It's a tie bag for dirty clothes. I'll probably put a garbage bag into it, but it's really cute. So that'll be for dirty clothes. Put a little white garbage bag in it so that it's anything wet isn't gonna seep through and yeah i'll be set so next this is like a almost like a terry cloth swaddle i've got it in quite a few colors it'll also be really good for um, breastfeeding and yeah it's super soft and i really like the the color palette on these ones I think they're really I can't imagine how many times I've said cute during this video but they are they're really cute got a couple um, of the what what is this it's not flannel is it flannel 
No, it's cotton. It's 100% cotton. So 100% cotton, um, like burp cloth material. So I can use them as burp cloths or blankets. And then this is a swaddle, like a swaddler. Yeah. So he's got that too. And next we get into some bibs and clothing. Ah! This is the funnest part. So I'm bringing these bibs just for spit ups or for spit. We got like some airplanes. I got a soft pink one, beige, and then these flower guys. And yeah, I think all of those are really adorable. Next are sleep onesies. I've got two Winnie the Pooh ones. So that's one Winnie the Pooh, two Winnie the Pooh. And then just a plain white. And you'll notice that all of these are zip ups. I, um, aside from a special few, I don't have any button ups. It's all zip. Next is for um, tops and pants. And then I also have the cutest little socks as well, which, where are they? Oh, I forgot hats, and there's the socks. All right. So I'm bringing these guys. They're all kind of the same, except this one doesn't have the arms like the other ones do. Not the arms, the little hand foldovers. And then I got little pants. Oh, they're so cute. Oh my gosh. Yep. All right, now we're going to his coming home outfit, which I'm so excited about. I'm excited about it all, obviously, but this is so cute. This is his little coming home outfit, and it's going to be cold out by the time he comes, so I've got a little hat for him. Yeah. All right. Let's get into hats, and I'm not going to show you all the socks that I'm bringing because it seems silly to do so, but they're little, they're Winnie the Pooh socks. Yeah, <laughs> super cute. And then I got some hand covers, which have a long, um, yeah, on them. And then I've just got some of the plain ones as well, which these ones don't work as good, but I'm bringing them anyway. Yeah. Now for little hats. A little knitted one. And again, they give you hats in the hospital, but I wanted to bring some of my own. Yeah. Cute. And that's what I've got in my baby's to go bag. Really hope you guys liked this video. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching the video. I hope you come back for more. I can definitely show you my hospital bag and all of my postpartum care things. And yeah, much love. I'll see you in the next one.